morning guys it's now 4 53 in the morning if you know you know i'm on my way to the gym I'm trying to get there for five o'clock i'm about to go pick up my gym partner and then we are gonna head to the gym um i look a hot mess today why didn't you guys tell me that my eyebrows look crazy in my last vlog but today we're gonna go get my nails done my brows done and um we're gonna wash my natural hair because I'm putting a wig on tomorrow. Let me get my playlist bumping. I'm on iTunes, of course. Um, the playlist I'm going to play is my 25 most played songs. And work hard just to I have my Essentia. I'm up and I'm ready to go. I ain't coming through and let the back straight. <laughs> See y'all at the gym. Cheyenne, say good morning. Good morning. Like, I right know we're at the gym. At 5.20. We're a little late. Yeah, we're a little late. Right, but we're here. And we're about to get this workout popping. So, I'm not going to be able to film much in here today, but it's like day. And this is what we're getting into. Okay, y'all. So, I'm home now. Fresh out the gym, fresh out the shower, still feeling like shit. Um, I'm gonna make some breakfast really quickly and I'm sorry that I gotta look a freaking hot mess every single time I get on this camera, but we're gonna get ourselves glammed between today and tomorrow, so deal with me and this natural beauty, okay? For breakfast, I'm gonna have some egg whites with um, spinach and water so i'm gonna make this really quickly i have organic um eggs and then i have my spinach hair which is already cooked by my mom and i absolutely love it it's not a lot i am probably going to take bro what is going on here <sighs> seriously all of that I'm gonna take three eggs and I'm gonna show you guys how I make my egg whites. If you don't know how to make egg whites on your own, they do sell it by itself in a container at the grocery store, which I should have got. That would have been so much better, but I'm gonna just use regular eggs for today. So I only get the egg white part out, which is the white stuff around the yolk. I make sure I get all of it too because I don't want to waste it. And this is the yolk right here, which I'm just not going to mess with at all. Then for seasoning, it's going to be really simple. I'm going to take some onion powder because I love onion. I'm going to take some Cajun seasoning. And because I really like spice, this doesn't do it as much for me, but I want it for the flavor and the salt. Now to make it spicy, I'm going to use some cayenne pepper. Plus I have a coal right now, so this is going to be really good for me. Then I'm going to just whip it up. I have my frying pan. And I have some extra virgin olive oil. Which I'm going to just drizzle a little bit. Just like that. On the pan. Then I'm going to turn the stove on. To like medium. Now that the pan is getting heated, I'm going to wait until I see like some bubbles in there. And I'm going to add my spinach. So, well, it's actually baby pop choy because I'm a little bougie over here, okay? Um, I'm going to add this to the oil just to heat it up. And then I'm going to add my egg whites. So that seems to be hot enough for me. I'm going to... Please, if you're gonna try this and you're underage, make sure you have a parent around. It's gonna get hot really quickly. 
so then I'm going to add my egg whites now. Right on top. And just let it, you know, get a little white for a second. And of course, I'm going to get on Instagram and I'm going to snap it on Instagram because I really want to encourage you all to live a healthier lifestyle. Period. So make sure you follow me on Instagram because I'm always, always posting what I do throughout the day. I want to get it to where it's not so watery. And I'm going to eat this by itself with some water. Alright, we should be good on that. Um, mm, mm, mm. I cannot wait to dive in. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna have a good time. We're gonna have a good time. Alrighty, dolls. I'm currently in the nail salon getting my toes done. If you know, you know. This is gel color. And then I'm gonna get my eyebrows done. I just finished my toes. Now I'm gonna get my brows waxed. Oh, this hair is like a scary sight, so I'm gonna try to block it out. So she's never done my brows before, but I'm trusting her today because I have no choice. Push me like y'all. Like I'm crying. I feel like my edges just got snatched. So my eyes are really blurry because they're sensitive. I'm sick right now. I like them. I'm not in pain. Okay. In my opinion, she did a great job. The only thing is, look at what the wax did to my skin. Like, I had to go home and exfoliate and try to wash it off and moisturize it. But it really dried out my skin. And now there's redness. So, I'm going to have to take care of that as soon as I get home. So, I'm back in the car and right now I'm on Pinterest. And I'm just looking for some nail inspo. I really um, need some nail inspo because I don't know what I'm about to do to my nails. I'm outside the nail salon. Help me, guys. Help me. I'm going to a wedding on Friday, so I need something, like, really, really, really calm. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I have absolutely no idea. I hate this about me. I'm such an indecisive person. It makes it so hard for me to make basic decisions. So, let's go in the nail salon and just... Let's just see. Let's just see what happens. Alright, so I'm in the nail salon and I'm with one of my favorite nail types. Let me show you guys the inspo for what we're going to do. So, this is what we're going to do right here. I'm excited. How long? Um, a little long. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Can I have you? Sure. Can I have you? Picture. A oh, picture of me? Oh yeah. Oh. It's good. So beautiful. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
，它这个妆化一下就不一样了，漂亮，觉得。And so y'all remember when I told you I was indecisive, right? Why is this hand nude and the other hand pink? I have a major problem. I need help. Okay, guys, I absolutely love this set. It was a struggle because I'm indecisive, but I love it. What do you think? Oh my God, I don't even I don't even know how I'm still functioning right now. I'm obsessed with my nails, but I am tired. Like, I look sick, I feel sick. Like, this is one of the worst I have felt in a long time. Between my previous vlog and this vlog, this is the worst that I've ever felt on camera. This is disgusting, but I gotta get this content out. If I had shades on, I'd have felt so much better. But what are we gonna do? Like, what are we gonna do? I'm hungry, so what are we eating? Clearly, I'm addicted to the Juicy Bar. Clearly, I got another salmon wrap today with some, what is this? I think some regular like wedge steak fries. Oh my God. I cannot wait to get home and devour you. Ugh. The way this salmon wrap and french fries is about to bust. Oh my god. Good morning. <laughs> I'm in such a better mood today. Um, on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the best, I probably feel about a 7-ish. Way better. I definitely feel way better than yesterday. Once I got home after I slam danced that salmon wrap, it was it for me. I had to go to bed. I was out for the night. I did the salmon wrap, I washed my hair, and it was over for me. I was out like a light. These are the products that I used on my Y last hair. Um, this is the leave-in conditioner. This is the Cantu Shea Butter for Natural Hair Cleansing Cream Shampoo. And this is the Sulfate Free Hydrating Cream Conditioner, all from the same brand. And it basically tames and detangles my hair really, really easily. And this hair is my beautiful Filipino body full lace wig that I will be putting on. It's 16 inches long, but today we're going to be cutting it into a nice blunt bob. Look at the lace. It's so beautiful. Can't wait to install it. But here we are, 8.15 in the morning. We're getting it. Big early birds get the big early worms, okay? We got this hair tamed a little. I'm gonna get my hair done. And now we about to start, so I'm gonna show you dolls what we looking like when I'm done. Ooh. Do y'all see what the hell is going on right here? Oh my god. <laughs> so I'm back in the house, guys, and as you can tell, I am completely feeling myself. Why did my hairstylist snap like this? I'm still trying to figure it out. Like, she snapped. This is my first bob ever, and I am absolutely freaking loving it like i feel like billy badass right now i feel ugh. don't mind the shades i'm not taking them off because this is my mood right now i'm a whole mood right now at this point you just need to freaking screenshot me because i'm a fucking mood right now i'm just going off right now and you know sometimes you just need that you you need to feel like you the baddest on the planet and that's what I feel like right now. Me doing my nails, me getting my brows done, my toes done. I just feel so much better and I was 
really in a crappy shitty mood from this flu that i have but here i am and i feel like i'm back again back the back made back stack the m what do you dolls think how do you guys feel about my bob i really want your opinions let me know what you guys think in the comment section below give me a thumbs up if you like this new look that'll let me know that i need to like stop playing it safe and step out my comfort zone because i normally would just do my filipino body full lace wig 26 inches and just curl it up and i've never just said i'm gonna do something different until today that's just how I've been feeling lately. I've been feeling real powerful. Real, I'ma do whatever that comes to my mind. Like, that's how I've been feeling lately. Shout outs to the Beauty Loft New York. Click the link in my description box right below and go copy you a wig, honey. It's so versatile, like, oh my God. Thank you all so much for coming along with me through this long ass day. Thank you for putting up with my ugliness and um, make sure y'all join the notification gang. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more freaking content.